briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. The United States Court of Appeals for the District of Columbia Circuit heard a case in 1999, Hudson v. Federal Aviation Administration, centered around the argument that the FAA did not follow proper procedures when creating a policy statement. The group that raised the issue claimed that the FAA did not adequately evaluate the safety of airplane designs when awarding a type of airplane certificate without conducting an emergency evacuation test. They argued that the FAA was required by law to give public notice and allow feedback before implementing the policy statement. The FAA countered that the procedure they followed was correct and that the policy statement was insignificant enough to not require public notice and feedback. The court conducted an analysis of the FAA's responsibilities, rules, and procedures to determine their actions' legitimacy. In the end, the court found that notice and comment rulemaking was not necessary and that the issuance of the type certification was not illegal. As a result, the court dismissed the petition, upholding the FAA's decision to issue the policy statement without public notice and award the airplane certificate. The court ruled that the FAA's actions were legal, in line with its responsibilities, and followed airplane safety standard rules, concluding that the policy statement was not a significant regulatory amendment that would require further public input. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.